I'm just wanting to get rid of this gap in between the tire and the top of the fender. Hey, hey guys, how's your day going? My day has just got a little bit better. First off, I don't know if it's just me or if it's guys and girls, all car enthusiasts, but when you get something for your car in the mail and you're having to drive home, man, it is like the best feeling in the world. Can you guys agree to that? Well, today my iBox Sportline Springs came in today for the Genesis and I thought I would do an unboxing video and then this is gonna be like a three-part video one is unboxing the next will be the install and like before and after and then another one for like a review of how it does for me on a daily basis because I drive my car daily so we'll see and review how these springs do and hopefully if you guys are in the same market as me and not really wanting to stance your car and happen to daily and it coming down to price maybe the iBox Sportline Springs will be the right route for you also so let's get started for this unboxing video here's the, the iBox Sportline Spring box it did come from UPS from California and it doesn't look like it's in too bad shape I mean it's it's got all of the protective strapping and stuff on there, I guess. I don't know. Oh, it's because it's a, it's a slide-up box. So let me take this apart and see what's inside. All right, and as we can see, I mean, there's there's not really a whole lot to say. I mean, like, it's got the the Eibach logo on it. These would be the front springs. And it came with new bump stops. And then the rear springs, you can tell it has the, has an R. I don't know if you guys can see that. There you go. It's got an R on there for the rear. And it's got these black like bump stops. So like when the spring compresses under a whole lot of pressure, it won't cling like the majority of cheaper off-brand springs do. So yeah, I mean like I I don't I don't know really what else to to really show you. I mean like they got they're they're pretty stiff. I mean it's not like I can go and put a whole lot of pressure on it anyways. But it looks like it came with like a manual instruction. Yeah, that's pretty much it for the unboxing. All right, guys. I mean, I don't, I don't really have a. That's not really like a, a very well unboxing, but I mean, you just open the box and you see the springs there. But just make sure to stick around. This oh. I did forget to say that this is for a 2013 Hyundai Genesis Coupe 3.8. This is the R-Spec edition, but I don't, it's not gonna make a difference anyways. But So make sure to subscribe, make sure to come back, and hopefully later on I will make another video um, sometime soon. I know you can tell that I'm in a jacket, so it is pretty cold. We're supposed to get some more snow, so it'll be, definitely be after that. So make sure to subscribe and then you'll be the first one to know whenever I do install them. And, and then that video will be uploaded and then you guys will be able to see how, how to install possibly and like before and after. If you guys are looking for the same kind of 
thing that I was, not really trying to stand your car, but just get, get rid of that drop. Here, I'll show you real quick. Like, <laughs> if you can see, like, I'm just wanting to get rid of this gap in between the tire and the top of the fender. And they're, they are supposed to, they are supposed to drop the car up to two inches once the car has settled, once the springs have settled. This is the rear. And then for the front, it's a little bit darker because I'm in my garage. There you go. And it's about two inches there too. But hopefully it'll look a lot better once it has been lowered. That's what's, I'm so stoked. I'm so happy right now, like me driving home, I just couldn't get home fast enough because I wanted to open that box so bad. It was like Christmas all over again. But like I said, make sure to subscribe, make sure to hit that thumbs up button, make sure to come back and check out the later videos. Go look at my other videos. Always remember, keep it random. Peace. Yeah.